I'm Matt Thad, and this is Science Mom. We're headed for challenge problem number 28. What do you have for me today? Another river crossing problem. So just like last time, I had a little warm-up exercise here with the farmer needing to cross the river with a cabbage, goat, and wolf. And he can't leave the goat with the cabbage can't or the... the wolf with the goat. That's right. So there's some incompatibilities that have to be avoided. And we're going to skip it and move on to the main event. In this case, there are four authors and four agents. Ooh. Once again, we have jealous agents who refuse to let the, their client be in the presence of another author without they themselves another agent. Being, uh, another agent without they themselves being present. Okay. So last time we had three and we crossed them over. This time we have an island. That's right. There's an island in the middle of the river, which may or may not come in handy. We'll see. Can you do it without the island if you have four pairs? No, you have to have the island. You have to have it. Okay. You have to have the island. Nope. Okay. So, how do we get these four across? Remember, only two can be in the boat at a time. Mm -hmm. And the, the lowercase letters, the authors always have to be with their agent if there are other agents around. Right. So, for example, we've got this A up top. Mm -hmm. It's okay for author A to be over here, but agent A can't be over here because that leaves author A with the other three agents. Might sign a contract with a different agent. Yeah, we just, just, can't, have just that. can't risk it. Yep. All right. All right. Any questions? I'm ready. How much time? You, you, you get four minutes because there are four authors and four agents. All right. I'll see, see what, what I, I did there? The four? Uh, I'll see what I can do. Okay. If you're watching at home, please pause now. Try to solve it on your own. Science Mom, your time starts now. Okay. So since, since the island um, is going to come in handy, I'm guessing that it'll work out well. Last time it, I, I got some authors over by themselves and that seemed to help a lot. So I'm going to have B and C transport their authors ah, to the island. That was not allowed. That was not allowed. You, you weren't allowed to get agency oh. touching the island where author B is without his agent. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. But C, little C and little D could just get in the boat sure, together. Sure, sure, sure. Those two could And drop. then they can drop off okay. at the island. Then D can come back and that's fine because sure. the agent's there. And A and D could get in the boat. So now we have all of the authors out of the way. Okay. Um, D is going to come back and say, hey agent, let me take you, whoops, I got to get in the boat first. Let me take you across the river and I will leave you on the other side. And agent uh, D says, oh, sorry. that's great. Wait, what, what's going to happen next? Um, well now D cannot go back and see these other agents. So he's going to go to the island and say, hey, writer friends, you need to move your agents. And they're going to come here. Agent B, do you want to go ride for a ride with me? Yes, I do. Drop off. Go get your agent. And then they're going to go and drop off this agent. And then A is going to say, go get your agent. Bing, bing. And drop off agent A. So now we have all the agents across and... <laughs> Yay! And now getting the authors across is not a big deal because they can be together in a boat without getting jealous. So, let's see, we'll get D, and then they will both go across and both get off. Look at that, yes. two minutes flat. Too easy. It, it helps that I had a very similar problem last week, I think. Not bad. Yeah, thank you. Way to go, Science Mom.